All right, fella. Day 47, halfway to 100, basically. Oh, today's back day. I ended up staying up like the majority of last night, literally just playing poker on Red Dead. Like me and the cowboy fellas in the fucking saloons. Um, I remember like, you know when you, you're supposed to chase the reverend down? And then the reverend, he's like pissed drunk. That's the first poker game and you have the option to play it or not play it. I played that one and got absolutely trashed. Like prior to this, I've only played poker maybe two times in my life. Neither of those times I was good. Maybe a few hands, I had beginner's luck, so I did win a few, but um, I never really knew what I was doing. After spending all of these hours just on Red Dead playing fucking poker, I actually have a good bit of confidence in my abilities now to play poker and win. Um, but that's besides the point. It's a very fun game. Now we have to go hit back day. I think I'm gonna structure the workout similar to how I did at the chest day. So like two heavy sets of rows, two heavy sets of pull downs, and then we do four antagonizing squeezing sets. What will that be? I'm not sure. It'll, uh, see even now I'm thinking, Mm. Okay, so maybe I do two sets after the rows of neutral grip pull downs as heavy as I can go, and then following that, two lighter sets of really wide grip lat pull downs, and then finish it out with the. Yeah, I actually do have an idea. Yeah, yeah. I'll put two plates on each side and we'll do that, that fucking pulling motion where you pull from the floor up. Um, yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good. I'm gonna fucking try and make that a drop set so the pump goes crazy. And then we go back home, eat a ton, and play more Red Dead. Um, oh yeah, you might have seen, if you watched yesterday's, that I was just like mouthing, <laughs> like, like going, ma, 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 right before my sets. Yeah, I'm just, um, as per the recommendation of Sam Sulek, I put on Skillet. If you don't know who Skillet is, then I'm afraid you haven't, like, you didn't grow up at the same time as me <laughs> because um it's basically just this rock band like three days grace something like that but like when i was a kid i remember you know when we were kids and we looked how to get up abs in 60 seconds or whatever and you're there working out on your fucking bedroom floor hoping nobody walks in to see you because you'll be embarrassed <laughs> yeah i was listening to skillet in those days so it's like bringing back a core memory but man like working out to their music is a joy and a half so i'm gonna do that shit again today but right now we're on the way to get take a guess cranberry juice and water you already know <laughs> um but yeah after that we get to the gym and we relax oh yeah i think yesterday i successfully went through the day without having any of the blinker so we're on the up and up fellas hopefully i get some news back about my employment situation and then fucking hell we really are on the up and up but i'll talk to you later all right fellers all right fellers got my cranberry juice got my spring water i also noticed that they have rebranded or repackaged the freeway cola that i'm a big fan of so i have a feeling i'm gonna have an itch for that after the gym any uh any guesses on what the yummy treat for today is gonna be because i don't fucking know but you'll know after i tell you <laughs> but yeah like i can already feel that i'll want a yummy treat after the gym honestly kind of contemplating ice cream well we'll see anyway time to go head back you already know <laughs>
Oh man, what a good good training. Um, there is one thing or two things I could change. I don't know if you've seen at the end there, but I did this kind of upper back row. Never really done that before. I really tried to like focus on getting a good squeeze, but because I'm unfamiliar with some machine, it wasn't as great as it could have been had I used a different machine. So let's recap. We did two sets, well, we worked up two sets of heavy ass rows. Heavy ass rows being 80 kilos this time. I know we got 100 last time for a few reps, but the form was kind of dog shit. So this time I bent over a bit more and used more of the muscles that should be used. Um, yeah, did two sets of that. Um, oh, <laughs> the last set I put on, a, if you watch Dragon Ball, you should know, um, when Goku turns Super Saiyan 3, put like a remix of that on. So I really like busted my ass trying to get the most reps as possible. And then we moved on to, uh, neutral grip lat pull downs. Um, I warmed up a little bit. I did like a few reps on 70, then 80. And then the stack, which is 100 kilos. That's what we did our working sets on. That first set was pretty fucking phenomenal, not gonna lie. I think I got like 14 reps or something crazy. And then I did it again and I got like 10. Following that, we put on the regular bear and then did wide grip pull downs. Um, slow and steady. Um, did like 60 and then 50 and then final set was a drop set just burning it out and then for the last exercise I was contemplating doing what I had set out to do in the morning you know when you're uh, when you're pulling from the ground up um, but I decided against that because I was already so exhausted I didn't want to move weight on and off the fucking bear because it just seemed like a fucking chore, an unnecessary chore. So I went on to find a machine that catered to my needs. And I was met with that upper row machine, upper back row machine. Um, like I did a few test reps on like 20 kilos and it felt pretty good. It, it like, it hits a lot of the traps, not gonna lie. Like it hits a lot of the traps. I noticed that when I was even checking in the mirror, like my traps were like, boom, you know? Looks like I was taking roids or something. Um, then, yeah, that's it. Then we just went to fucking pose down and had a shower. And don't tell anyone, but I fucking yoinked a roll of toilet paper from the fucking bathroom. <laughs> like, why not? You know, I need some. <laughs> anyway. I don't know if it was on your bingo cards, but the yummy treat that I decided to get is um, cookie dough ice cream. So if you didn't choose that one, you lost. Sorry, bro. Better luck next time. Better luck next time. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to go to the shop and get that cookie dough ice cream. And some beef mints too. And then tomorrow's Monday. Tomorrow is what? Oh, fuck. I wish I could hit chest again, honestly. <laughs> Cause like that yesterday's chest day was just fucking phenomenal. Um, but now tomorrow is probably shoulder day. I think I'll add in some traps into that too, because I haven't been looking out for them as much as I should be. But no, no, what am I saying? It's arm day, baby. It's arm day tomorrow. <laughs>